What's going on, guys? Welcome back to the Gala Empire. And we hope you guys got, got a lot, lot accomplished. accomplished. In today's video, guys, we'll be doing a shoe review of the Yeezy 700s Blue Tints. Blue Tint. Man, we're going to tell you guys what we think about these. If you are new to the channel, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell, join the Gala Empire, and make sure to follow our social medias at Gala Kicks, at Kicks the Ball to stay yes, updated with everything. the whole nine everything. yards. We appreciate you guys. We're on the road to 900, 900 subscribers. subscribers. We're two subscribers Too away. short. So if you are new to the channel, please smash that subscribe button. Let us know that you just subscribed and we're going to get right into this video. All right, guys, now that you've seen these things up close and personal, let us know what you think about them, how you feel about them. Did you cop them? Did you pass on them? Today was the release day. We are at July 5th today. Yes. Today. Yes. Happy yeah. Independence Day for, you know, yes. yesterday was the holiday. Yes, I know. We hope you guys stay safe and enjoy that time. But let's talk right into this, what we like and what we don't like about the shoe. So you got, let you go first. Well, you know, I, I'm, I've been looking to cop a Yeezy 700, but I'm just waiting for another black colorway to cop. Because I haven't been feeling none of the um, none of the colorful colorways that drop. For example, the orange ones, these, I'm not really feeling too much. I just want a black simple one. Because to me, this shoe is an everyday wear, you know? It's not a the most hype Yeezy. This 700 colorway is not the most hype, you know what I'm saying? So this just looks like a comfortable shoe that I would rock on a regular day. Yes. What about you? Um, what I like about it, I like the colors. Like I like the blue and I like the black, and I love like the um, gray here, which is reflective. reflective. Um, I like that as well. I like overall. I like the shoe. It's just that I don't. I wouldn't wear these because I'm not a Yeezy fan. I don't like Yeezys. I don't like. I have a the only Yeezy I have is a 350. Um. What is the here? three, the, the, the three fifty, um, the black, black not, and red, yeah, three fifty, the breads. Well, the, not the OGs though. The bread three fifties, yeah. and you also have the five hundred utility blacks. Oh yeah, I do have the five hundred utility. Blacks. I forgot all about that. Yeah, but, but anyways, these, I wouldn't cop these. Nah, I, I don't know. I I'm feel just, like the blue is too pale on this one. Like the blue, as you can see, this is how exactly it looks. It's not the brightness. This is exactly how it looks when it comes to. It's a teal, very light, 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 light. light, 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 light. Blue. Light blue, not a baby blue, sky blue. It's a very teal looking light blue, like a watered down blue. Yeah, but I guess he had um Kanye decided to make that feature to make the reflective pop out more. Exactly. But other than that, yeah. Don't mind this in the shoe. I'm just putting it so that the shoe doesn't look deformed. I took like it out of another one. shoe. See how exactly. It goes down. This is more up. Exactly. I'm just making sure so you guys can see. This is how it look on foot. On foot. Yep. All right, guys, we're going to jump in right into this resale about this shoe. Now, they are not doing that well. Well, yeah. they sell now. As you Under all know, retail. Stock eggs got to make their profits. You all know how this go. So, stock eggs, they're going for around 200 the retail sell now. Sell now. So if you wanted to sell your shoe to stock eggs, you know, you only make two hundred dollars. And the retail a $30 L. was two thirty five. Okay. Well, stock eggs to be exact is two oh six. You make two hundred six dollars, and the retail. So you is lost twenty nine dollars. Yes, basically. But if you buy on stock eggs, you won't believe this. You, it's going to be costing you two hundred and eighty three dollars. Whooping two hundred eighty three dollars. So, so man, they just ripping people off. Huh? Stock eggs is definitely making their money when it comes to this. But, but hey, it's a, business. it's a business at the end of the day. So if you have these in hand, like we always mention, a shoe like this, it is best to get grabs so you can meet a new customer if you yes. build your brand meet a new client but besides that these are not doing too 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 well too 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 well but they're still limited so let us know what you guys think if these if they if the value of stock x is not that good like they like stock x don't know what they're doing that these should be worth more or you feel like that's about right exactly honestly these weren't hard to find but these weren't easy to get they weren't really 
um, in every single store. Like no, these past limited. Jordan fours that just came out, but very yeah. very limited. So well, not very limited, but definitely not everywhere. Not a source you can find everywhere. Yes. So I honestly don't think this shoe is gonna be a uh, three fifty four hundred dollar shoe anytime soon. What do you think? I think it's gonna go up over time, and I'm talking about all the way How to long? the roof. Um, Give me a three hundred dollar shoe, and how long you think it's gonna take? It's probably gonna take maybe a month. No, actually less than a month. I give it three weeks. This is gonna be worth something because it's so limited. Wow, wow. All right, we will see. Let us know down below what you guys think. How long? How long you think it's gonna take for this shoe to become three hundred dollars plus? Plus, Basically, when it comes yeah. to sell now and buy now. Let us know, guys. All right, guys, before we end out this video, and we're gonna show you one last clip of the shoe, I wanna just express that this shoe right here only was first come, first serve, and only very few stores. Two stores. Okay, Near very us. two stores, right? There's, we have a BBC. I know you guys, if you never heard of Billionaire Boys Club, it's an Adidas store where they get all the latest releases Adidas like this. Adidas contract. Yes, they have an Adidas contract. And they get all the latest Adidas like this, and they ain't even get them in store, surprisingly. So I just want to be clear that this shoe was very limited in stock when it comes to this, and a lot of people didn't touch them. Let us know if any store, how many stores around you got these these shoes? I would yes. like to know where, and let us know where you're where you're watching us from. I really yes. want to know and where it, you guys watching from and which stores, how many stores around you had these. That's true, and it's, it it really is a big difference between like places like Miami and places like Atlanta because shoes like this will in, end up sitting on the shelf for a long time before they get sold out in but, certain places. Yeah, in certain places, and in Miami, man, you're not gonna see this after release day. It flows. Mm -hmm. I guess, after an hour after the release 10 yeah. 11 o'clock after midday you're not finding them i guess because it's just a tourist city but yes it's very hard to find heat in stores we have to do a lot of footwork because of everything that goes on with like people want to buy the same thing uh, our, and our reseller population down here is huge uh, yes. i have a lot hype of beast. resellers and hype beasts in miami that just want to cop for retail i don't want to pay the resale price that's willing to do the footwork down here like man there's been more people ever since we've started we've seen we're starting to see new faces every time there's a new camp. New faces yes. every time there's a first come first serve. New faces every single time there's a new shoe come out coming out. We have to go sign up for a raffle for. Yes. So it's gotten so bad that even the tourists that come down here for like a weekend will end up coming the first come first serve. No, or, and they can't pick up the shoe if yes, they if they if um, a raffle are picked. But nonetheless, these shoes were kind of limited around us. Don't forget to let us know down below where are you watching us from and which stores around you had these shoes how like not which but how many stores around you had these shoes two three yes let us know if you even feel in this shoe one last look of it before we end it off if you feel what's the detail you like about it i say my favorite detail have to be the reflective parts you can't go wrong with that but besides that the blue is too pale for me yes but this was the shoe review of the 700 blue tints if you are new and you watch this far, please don't forget to, guys. Make sure to subscribe. All I want you to do at this point is subscribe, okay? We need you to subscribe and hit that red button. Oh, yes. Please don't forget to smash that bell, you know, every time we get... Smash that yes, bell, but most of all, I need you to subscribe, man. Subscribe yes. and join the Gala Empire because we are on the road to a thousand. Oh. Not 900 no more. We're on the road thousand. to a thousand. Let's get it. Because all we need is two to reach 900 subscribers. So now we're on the road to 1,000. Help Let's us reach it. our goal. We appreciate you for watching. Thank you for showing us the support. Don't forget to comment down below everything we asked you guys. But yes. we hope you guys got, got a, a lot, lot accomplished. accomplished. Hope you guys enjoyed this shoe review. Let us know again down below what you think. We'll see you in the next one.